Make sure you watch this entire video. Absolutely free game breakdown. Wednesday night college football between Kent State and Akron. These are two teams that are both one and seven, but somebody has to win this game. Before we get into this breakdown, make sure you subscribe to this page. Hit that like button. Slam that like button, actually. Leave us a comment. Become part of that comment crew that we used to give shout outs and I kind of got away from shout outs for a while. I'm going to get back to the shout outs uh, because I think, I think you guys deserve it, right? But when I go to my last video, we got Miguel Martinez and that's it. We got on Billy's video, R. Jacobson and Joseph Anderson. Much love and appreciation. I'm going to do one more video. Packers always. Another shout out. Uh, my Air Force winner from last week. This was a big one. We got KJ Philly 5 Teamer, Brother Boomin, Prairie Hill Pups, and Matthew Sheriger. Guys, we appreciate those shout outs. If we get a video with 20 comments, we're going to pick the best comment and ship a t shirt your way. So make sure you hop on that and take advantage of that. Now, Kent State comes into this game after recording a loss against Buffalo 24 to 6 last time they took the field. They have a 1 and 6 record overall, dropping five straight games in a row. They only scored 10 touchdowns this season. These are not good teams. Let's just get that very straight. Neither of these teams are good teams, but got to make a prediction on it because someone's got to win. And I think there's a little bit of a line flaw in this game, so I'm going to attack it. Uh, defensively, they're giving up 33 points a game, 375 yards. Not good stuff. I mean, these stats are abysmal. I could just go on and on and on. They've put up 10 touchdowns. They've given up 33. I mean... This is just not good stuff. Akron come into this game losing their last game against Bowling Green, 41-14. to um, Another bad team, 1-7, six straight losses in a row. They're only putting up 15.4 points per game, 280 yards. Not good stuff. And defensively, once again, giving up 29 total touchdowns, giving up almost 200 in the air and 150 on the ground giving up 29.4 points per game. They're giving up twice as many points as they are scoring. You cannot succeed when you're giving up that kind of action. Now, here's where it gets interesting, guys. I'm looking at this game, and Kent State, historically, in the last few years, does usually win this game. Um, they are... 6-1 and one against the spread in the last seven against Akron. You can look at some teams that both of these teams have faced, uh, Buffalo being one of them, Kent State lost to them, Akron lost to them, Akron lost to them a little by a little bit less. Uh, Ohio, Buffalo got beat by them pretty bad. They actually didn't play Ohio. So these are two teams, guys, that – like I said, they're just not good, but somebody has to win. Somebody has to cover the spread. And Kent State in this matchup seems to have that covered. They cover that spread, and I like the way the line's moving on this game. I am taking Kent State plus the 3.5. Kent State plus 3.5. Actually looking on the board right now, you can get this game right now probably at four and a half. So I would get it at four and a half if you can. Kent State plus four and a half, lock it and lock it.